factorize 9x square plus 7x minus 260 to factorize step 1 coefficient of x square that is 9 here should be multiplied to the constant minus 260 we get minus 2340 this is your step 1 next now you should look out for two numbers such that when you add these two numbers you should get middle coefficient plus 7 and also when multiplied you should get minus 2340 I repeat now you should look out for two numbers such that when you add them you should get middle coefficient plus 7 and also when multiplied you should get minus 2340 to get those two numbers for that we should take LCM of 2340 so the LCM we take here the last digit 0 so take 5 the first number 2 smaller than 5 so take two numbers 23 a number close to 23 in 5 table is 5 4 20 23 minus 23 3 carried forward 34 a number close to 34 in 5 table is 5 6 30 34 minus 34 4 carried forward 40 when do we get 40 in 5 table 5 8 40 now last digit 8 even so take 2 First number 4, when do we get 4 in 2 table? 2, 2 is 4. The other number 6, when do we get 6 in 2 table? 2, 3 is 6. The other number 8, when do we get 8 in 2 table? 2, 4 is 8. Now last digit 4, even so take 2. First number 2, when do we get 2 in 2 table? 2, 1 is 2. The other number 3, a number close to 3 in 2 table is 2, 1 is 2. 3 minus 2, 1, 1 carried forward, 14. When do we get 14 in 2 table? 2, 7 is 14. Now last digit 7, not A1. So not divisible by 2. Next prime number 3. To check divisibility by 3, for that we should add the digits. That is 1 plus 1 plus 7. We get 9. Is 9 divisible by 3? Yes. So this number also divisible by 3. So we take 3 here. The first number 1 smaller than 3. So take two numbers 11. A number close to 11 in 3 table is 3. 3 is 9. 11 minus 9, 2, 2 carried forward 27. When do we get 27 in 3 table? 3, 9 is 27. Now last digit 9 not A1. So not divisible by 2. To check divisibility by 3, for that we add the digits. That is 3 plus 9, 12. Is 12 divisible by 3? Yes. So this number also divisible by 3. So we take 3 here. The first number 3, when do we get 3 in 3 table? 3, 1 is 3. The other number 9, when do we get 9 in 3 table? 3, 3 is 9. Now here we have 13. 13 is a prime number. So 13, 1 is 13. Now, the two numbers should be 5 into 3, 15 into 3, 45. And the second number is 2 into 2, 4 into 13, 52. 52 minus 45, 7, 52 into 45, 2, 3, 4, 0. So here you write 52 and here 45 now we should adjust the signs what i mean is over here we have plus 7 to get plus 7 we should put plus here and minus here plus 52 minus 45 is plus 7 plus 52 into minus 45 is minus 2340 so we have adjusted the signs now you change this to 9x square in place of plus 7x now we should write this plus 52x minus 45x 
minus 260. Did you understand? In place of plus 7x, we have written this. Next. Now from these two terms, what can be taken out common is x. So here you get 9x plus from this x out you get 52. Now whatever you got here, here also you should get the same thing. Now from this 9x has gone inside, outside you get minus 5. Even if you multiply and check still you get the same thing. Now you take out 9x plus 52 common. So here you have x and here minus 5. This is our answer. Am I clear?